Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, I am going to show you how to make a car parking simulator. So let's get started. So first thing first, let's delete this sprite. After that, go to upload backdrop and we will upload our own backdrops. Don't worry, I will give you the links in the description. You can also use it for yourself. So we will delete this backdrop because we don't need it. After that, it is fit to the screen. So for that, go to code area. And now we will upload a sound which is the background sound. So for that, go to sound area, delete this one and we will go to upload sound and we will use background sound. After that, go to code area, then go to events block. We will use when the flag has been clicked. Let's zoom in. When the flag has been clicked, after that, go to control block. We will use forever. After that, go to sound block. We will use play this sound after done let's see that's great so now it is working let's get our first sprite okay which will be our platforms okay that's good so it has four costumes okay so the code will be it will change its costume along with the level so for that go to events block when the flag has been clicked after that go to motion block we will use the center coordination which is double zero after that go to looks block we will use switch costume to we will use the first one okay after that go to control block we will use forever and then go to again looks block and we will use switch costume to but we will use a variable which will be our call level okay so we will use this one so it is appearing right here so we will hide it so the first code is completed. So this code means it will change its costume along with the level. Okay. And now let's get our second sprite, which is the cars. So let's see the costumes. It has the same number of costumes as we have in the parking spot. So the code will be the same. It will change its costume along with the level. So simply go to this sprite and drag this one and it will be right here. And now we will need a car to park because it is a parking game so for that go to upload sprite and then we will use this car so it is a bit bigger let's decrease its size to 30 okay that's better let's put it right here so the code will be whenever the flag has been clicked it will appear right here so for that go to events block when the flag has been clicked after that go to variables block we will set the level to one so this will be our first level okay and now let's go to motion block we will use this coordination after that it will be in the 90 direction position so if i put this one right here and i click on this one it will start from right here so now this car needs some motion so for that go to control block we will use forever after that we will use if then then go to sensing block we will use some keys like for example up arrow key so it will move in some steps so for that go to motion block we will use like for example five steps let's see that's good and now let's continue the code so we will need some direction so for that go to control block again we will use if then after that go to sensing block we will use again some keys like for example right arrow so it will change some degrees so for that go to motion block we will use degrees but in two degrees after that make a duplicate again and put it right here okay and simply change the arrow which will be left arrow and delete this block we will use this one but we will it will turn in two degrees let's see So now it is working again but we will need some reverse direction also so for that make a duplicate right here okay and let's put it right here simply change to down arrow okay and let's put negative sign let's see the overall results that's good and now the second code will be if it touches these cars or the wall of the parking lots it will restart the level so for that we will use 
go to events block when the flag has been clicked go to control block we will use forever and then we will use if then after that go to operators block we will use this code and we will go to sensing block we will use touching what touching level cars and we will add another thing which will be our colors the color of a parking lots we will add this red color and if it touches the cars or this one so it should make a sound so for that go to sound area we will upload a sound like skidding okay then go to code area we will upload go to sound block we will use some sound let's see some overview okay so now it is making some sounds so continuing the code we will need go to motion block we will need this coordination and we will use 0.90 in direction let's see okay so now it is working let's add some weight so for that go to control block we will use some weight let's see okay so when it touches the wall or the car it will wait for one second and then it will appear right here and now we will need some parking sign to where to park so for that go to upload sprite and we will use some sign like this one so again it has four costume as we have four levels so for that go to events block when the flag has been clicked after that go to logs block we will use switch costume to one which is the level one and then go to control block we will use forever after that go to looks block again and we will use switch costume to to level so for that go to variables block and we will use level okay actually look at the parking sign it is very simple so let's add some effects so for that go to events block when the flag has been clicked after that go to looks block we will use set some ghost effects okay like for example 90 percent after that go to control block we will use forever and we will use repeat like for example 30 times and then go to looks again and we will use change the ghost color sorry effect by 1.22 and simply make a duplicate and put it right here but it will be in negative direction and now let's look at this it looks amazing okay but we will also need some indication so for that go to upload sprite and we will use some arrows okay let's decrease its size to our desire okay and let's put it right here so the code for the arrow is same as the parking sign so simply we will go to this sprite and simply drag this one right here and this one also and let's click on this arrow sprite and arrange this and let's see the overall results okay great so in the last step if the game is completed there will be some design of you win so for that go to upload sprite and we will use this sprite okay so this is better and let's put it in the center so for making this code go to this sprite okay after that drag this one side ahead and we will use so the code is simple whenever the game is completed this will appear right here so for that go to events block when the flag has been clicked zoom it out then go to control block we will use forever and we will use if then after that go to operators block we will use this code okay let's put right here five because there are four levels okay and after that go to variables block we will use the level and then go to events block we will use some broadcast okay we will add a new message like for example you win after appearing right here the game should stop so for that go to control block we will use stop all so for completing this step we will have to go to this sprite and then go to events block we will use when i receive you win after that go to looks block okay we will use switch costume to 
you win and then the game should stop so for that go to control block we will use stop all so for completing this set we will have to go to events block we will use when the flag has been clicked after that go to logs block we will use hide so whenever the flag has been clicked it will hide okay let's see and we will use show right here okay let's see the overall results actually i really enjoyed making this game so please make sure to like and subscribe if you enjoy this video have a nice day and goodbye